Hello everyone, welcome to Easy Studios and today we are having a look at the Microsoft Flight Sim 2020 on the GTX 1080 Ti and Ryzen 5 3600. I also have 32 gigabytes of RAM at 3200 speed as well as running the game on a hard drive unfortunately but I don't think it made too much of a difference outside of loading times. And I'm just going to leave you with a whole bunch of examples here of different uh, cities and different uh, ranges of uh, locations. but. Most of the time I get between 20 and 30 FPS in highly dense areas like this one and above 30 FPS in less populated areas with less textures to render. Occasionally you may see uh, the ground textures don't look amazing and that's because my internet speed isn't great so it doesn't always download those textures right. But don't worry, I don't think that would make too much of a difference to FPS as um, a lot of the time we're constrained by the amount of building the game has to render, and the buildings usually are rendered pretty well, so don't worry too much about that. This is pretty much a worst case scenario running at ultra settings, and I wouldn't worry too much about those textures like you can, like you can see right now, actually. But yeah, I'll leave you with these benchmarks. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. There's a Discord server below if you'd like to join that for events and stuff, and if, if you have any questions, or suggestions in the comments below, that would be great. But essentially, I'm showing you a worst case scenario of the 1080 Ti for the Ryzen 5 3600 in Microsoft Flight Sim 2020. So, enjoy the rest of the benchmarks, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.